hey everyone, we're down at Heath Castle. Uh, you can see we've got we've got a little bit of mist. The water is dead still. A um, little bit of ripple at the top end up there. But it's, a, it's a lovely time of the day. This I love this. It's so peaceful before everyone gets you. Well, say everyone gets you. Pops is over on the other bank there somewhere. And uh, he's made a start. I've seen two fish move on the top now. Um, again, I've seen it humping over there now. Uh, or head and tail in, I should say. Not humping. <laughs> um, yeah, I've had two previous trips out here in the last week and a half or something. And the fishing has really gone tough. Uh, we did have that uh, bit of sunny spell. Uh, so I'm hoping today the conditions are meant to be rainy and a bit windy later on. Uh, thundery thunderstorm. So we'll see. Uh, I thought I'd set up. If it's anything like the last couple of weeks, I'll probably down to as little as four pound tippet, 15 foot long maybe at time, um, small imitative pattern. But it's encouraging seeing the few fish here now. So I'm going to have a cup of tea and I'll catch you later. Okay, so I've just started <clears throat> and I've set up now with uh, it's a seven weight line and rod, floating line. I've got my intermediate braid again on the end, the five foot length one, and about five to six foot of five pound um, fluoro carb, and my it's like a copper dow back with a gold head. I'm starting off with a varied figure of eight. Just seen a fish moving down there now. Okay, uh, time to change the flag. I know I'm covering the fish. I'm not really interested. So, off with the gold head, now back. I think I might try a pearly nymph or something. Okay, I did eventually tie the fly on. Uh, it lasted no more than 20 minutes or so. Uh, I lost a bit of confidence with it. I made a few more changes, uh, but I'm fishing now with a size 12 red buzzer. Uh, it's got a little bit of white on it. Uh, it's just a matter of slowing, slow everything up and just be patient and wait. There's five fishing up here this morning 
and this is the first fish, so I'm more than pleased. Strapping fish. Bad, yeah. Well, we've been here for the last two hours trying everything. On it. A scrapper. Him well. Is he done? That's the good thing about barbless in the net. That's the fly. I've done it. Lovely. Not bad. Okay, fish on. I had a oh, fish off. <laughs> I was with a, a damsel. Slowly fished. Yeah, uh, straightforward. Bit of green marabou, little green eyes, unweighted. Uh, first hit I've had for a while, so. Let's see if that will do any more again. Put it straight back out. Okay, I'm about done for the day. Uh, I hope you enjoyed the video. It has been really tough. Uh, I think it was about five or six up your fishing throughout the day and they all blanked bar one. Now fishing with the floating line, a longer tippet, small imitative patterns and working it as slow as you can obviously seems to be the trick. Uh, it's obviously locating where them fish are sitting it is probably going to be the biggest problem. When you're fishing as slow as that going around the water it's you're going to be spending a lot of time trying to locate the fish um, but once you do hopefully you will have a good day uh, I've thoroughly enjoyed the day 
So any comments would be good or subscribe or a thumbs up. So until the next video, take care.